This is a very common practice in political research to sum ordinal items into an additive scale. We can get very reliable and uh, useful scales of characteristics by combining codes of ordinal level variables. There's a very common type of ordinal scale, it's called a Likert scale, uh, is very common. I'll give you an example in a minute. All items in the scale must measure the same concept. The similarity of the questions ensures that only one concept is measured. So if you have all these items you're putting in an ordinal scale, they're all very similar. And we know methodologists tell us that the greater the number of questions, the more reliable the scale. Here's a very good example. This is a scale that's been asked in the American National Election Study, a battery of questions. Let's take a minute and look at this. Uh, this is a measure, uh, this, th these are scale items in a measure of egalitarian beliefs or egalitarianism. And it, look at the bottom here, it says, uh, respondents are asked, after looking at each statement, respondents are asked, do you agree strongly, agree somewhat, neither agree nor disagree, disagree somewhat, or disagree strong, strongly with this statement. So you can see it's like a five item ordinal measuring, in this case, degrees of disagreement. Say they're coded from one to five on, e, on, on these, these values. So these are ordinal values. Uh, our society should do whatever is necessary to make sure that everyone has an equal opportunity to succeed. succeed. So that's, if you agree with that, you're, that, that's an indicator of a greater egalitarianism. Item two, we've gone too far in pushing equal rights in this country. Well, see, that's reverse coded. And uh, question designers do this so that respondents don't fall into response set, just giving, just agreeing with everything or disagreeing with everything. But you can recode the values so that you can have a nice scale that's coded in one direction. One of the big problems in this country is that we don't give everyone an equal chance. Okay, that's measured in an egalitarian direction. This country would be better off if we worried less about how equal people are. Well, you get the idea, but imagine uh, coding these all in an egalitarian direction from say one to five, and then summing all those, you'd get a scale that would run from five at the low end to 30 uh, at the high end, and you'd get a very nice ordinal measure of egalitarianism. It's an open secret really in political science that when we get uh, real nice Likert scales like that or ordinal scales like this, um, we pretend they're, <clears throat> excuse me, we pretend that they are interval level scales. Thank you.